Ooh, you got it? All right. All right, man. Tap. I got to go get all that. I don't know. You I didn't brought some beer, though. Go grab some beers. Thanks, bro. So, you, so the drama with Tiffany now? Yeah, I'm still even lost all the chicks you're talking about. Yeah, it ain't as hard as it seems. I haven't heard from Tiffany at all. I'm giving her some space because I haven't tried to contact her or even text her or anything. And we've had just so much drama here just recently. I feel like you're hiding something. I'm just trying to understand what the f you got going on. Do you really want to do this? Get out of my face. Where are you going to go? It doesn't matter. It's not your business anymore. I miss Tiffany. She's just so easy to talk to, and I can tell her anything that's going on. And that's always a pretty good feeling, man, when you meet somebody and they just accept you for who you are and what you got going on. The way she blew up so quickly and just flipped on me, I really didn't get to explain everything. Yeah, I might have texted back a couple of chicks, but I'm not kicking it with them. You've been with me for a few days. I ain't had time to do nothing like that, so I didn't technically do anything. Yeah. You know, I feel like I might holler at her, see what the she's up to. That's what I would do. I don't even know what I should say. Just like, what's up? Hey, what's up, baby? Yeah. You miss me yet? Tell her you ditched those other two broads. That's what she said. Hello. Hello. How are you? I'm good. Your phone been turned off or something? I ain't heard from you since you run off. What do you want from me, Kevin? Well, I would like to have a, like a sit down with you and at least, you know, we can maybe talk in person and tell you miss her. You know, shit, and I want to, you know, see see what's going on with you. Uh, I don't know. I just have a lot on my mind right now, and I'll let you know what's going on. All right, bye. All right. Well, dude, I'm gonna be on like a devil's advocate type here, man. Like, you know, you got to see it from her point of view. You bring her back. You move over drawers. You have sex for the first time. She's going to think it's a relationship. No girl wouldn't, you know? How she reacted is almost justifiable, you know? Like, you got a point. Do I like having sex? Yes, I love having sex. But am I a sex addict? I don't know all that, but, you know, I mean, maybe that's why I can't stay faithful to one woman. I'm just right, waiting for the right one. When I first laid my eyes on her, it's like, I could definitely see myself growing on with Tiffany. Hopefully I can say the right words, you know? We'll just have to see how things go. Truth be told, I, I mean, it's going to be hard for me to get away from other females that I'm talking to or even to stop talking to them, you know? You're playing with fire, dude. Hello. Uh, dinner for two. Yeah. Enjoy. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Hey, hey. Come on, sit down. Mm-mm-mm. <laughs> so what's going on, woman? Just been going through the motions. Going through the motions, huh? Yeah. What about you? No, I missed you. I want to see you. Oh, you did? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Hmm. <laughs> what is that about? <laughs> you don't believe me? I have mixed feelings, I guess, about, you know, everything that happened. You lied to me. Who are you talking to? A couple friends of mine. I feel like you're hiding something from me right now. I'm just trying to understand what the f you got going on. You really want to do this? Did you expect that I wasn't talking to Dane women on her? In my mind, like, OK, I'm in prison. You're, of course, in the real world. So like, I know in the back of my head, like, you're doing whatever you're doing. But I just kind of expected it to be cut off I tried. The time. I tried, and I did. But then you started treating me differently. With the halfway house, I mean, I thought it was gonna be a whole lot more communication, and it went to like no communication. You ignored me, treated me like a sucker, and then had some dude on your release date that I had to beat up down there. So, me and you talked and built this great relationship the whole time I was in prison, and I was so excited. But the other part of me. I was scared. Like, I have trust issues. At the end of the day, like, I don't want to get my heart broken. Mm. Uh, you know, I've just always had a problem with, like, dating multiple women. I ain't gonna lie to you. Well, right? I'm not gonna lie either. Like, that's... So that's been my problem with a lot of relationships I've had, you know? Is that something that you're willing to, like, 
let go of. I just, in my mind, you know, when you've been locked up, you've told me you've had girlfriends, you've dated women outside and inside, and and and, and I don't know, you know, maybe we could figure something out or find somebody you like or somebody we both like or something. I don't know. Well, I think that is something, you know, that I would be willing to, like, explore with you. Hmm. I do know that I'm not willing to, like, let you go and lose you. I mean, you know I like women, and obviously I like men, and so... Well, we're not bringing no men into this. We never expected it. Yeah, you done did that enough. <laughs> not like that, though. I have never personally tried anything like this before. I think that we both might enjoy it a little bit. I mean, I know he's definitely going to love it because he gets, you know, more than one girl. <laughs> we don't have to take on somebody real serious or anything. I mean, we can, you know, whatever. A toy we can pick up and drop off whenever we want. <laughs> <laughs> you said that. That me. Tonight went very well for us. Oh, man. Cheers to he gets a girlfriend, I get a girlfriend, maybe. <laughs> this might be okay for us. Thank you so oh, much. Thank you, so much. Thank thank you, you too. I mean, you want to take her home? She's cute. <laughs> She's pretty young for me. <laughs> yeah, you're right. We definitely need to work on Earth first before we start worrying about somebody else, I believe. I feel like that is a very so, smart idea. We don't want to pull the trigger too quick on something that ain't you know, have a good foundation of women. In fact, I don't even care about the food no more. Let's go, baby.